We are back at it again. Um, time to face our divisional rivals. The uh, um, hold up, I just got a text. Alright, just some news there about Halo stuff. Nothing big. However... Let's start the season. We are in a bit of a pickle as we've been looking at our, uh, our cap space as of late. Uh, we did release a whole lot of players, however... We, uh simply do not have the money to pay uh our giant his giant bonus he wants of 106 that's just not plausible man it's really not seems to be Randy Bradley. This is an awful QB class. He seems okay at best. Yeah, I don't know, man. But, anywho, we're going to start with the... Against the uh, divisional rivals, the one and one Redskins, who already have a worse uh, season than last year, they went seven and zero before ending their streak, I believe, which is really impressive. Uh, especially because then we went to go beat them twice more. We'll let it play out. I'm in no r particular rush today. It's week three of the NFL on EA Sports. We'll 
think I might turn up the uh, game audio um, for the stream because the feedback from my mic, I don't actually think it's from the mic because my mic in parties doesn't sound like that. I think it's Twitch. I don't know. Kind of weird. Tampa Bay against the 0 2 New York Jets. Dwayne Haskins is still on their team. <laughs> Start with a blitz, keep them on their toes, you know. Darius Geis, man. And really want to play well for him. A gain of two. Look at the numbers for Geis a week ago. 16 carries, 87 yards. And well liked by his teammates. In fact, I got on good authority, even though I'm not an investigative reporter. That in their team meeting, they Excuse me, did they just. Ryan stood up and said, Coach, we've got to have better yardage for this guy. He's number nine in the league. He's got to be in the top three before the season's right. over. Let's roll with the ball. Excuse me, you're talking about Darius Geis. You're talking about Darius Geis, the woman abuser. Right? Right? God, I can't believe it said people were defending him in this game. That's just disgusting, man. Of all people, Darius Geis. It's the same with Kareem Hunt. Like, those are just people you don't defend. Okay, or just somehow get out of the tackle. That's fine. I swear, Jalen Smith is the worst good player we have. <laughs> good block, good block. Oh, how'd he get that out? Yeah, we'll play some more zone and just make sure they get the fourth down, you know? Good stuff. Could have been intercepted, but this is what it is. Oh, I, oh, I thought that, that was a good tackle. That was my bad. Should have been more. That was my bad. I think that's got five and two. I'll take it. I'll take it. I don't know what to do with him. He's just so expensive. So is Zeke. I think we'll keep on Zeke for two more years and then try to get rid of him. Just because that's the year they start regressing, typically. Alright, block. Block. Wow. Whoever knows. There, oh, that's Gallup. I thought I said 14 for a second. There we go. There we go. Brittingham. Who's Brittingham? What, what is our... <laughs> Hold up. Let's see. Brittingham. We'll go... Wide receivers. Eric Brown is number four. Is it a tight end? Jerome Brittingham. He's a linebacker. What is... <laughs> what? All right then. Oh wow! Wow! Yeah, that was a good rush. Ah, hold up. 
actually, we're gonna check what number they were. That was a good, I mean, just look at that. They utterly destroyed us. But okay, Brittingham here. Number 50. Is he actually, since he's technically the third string, well, why wouldn't Jarwin or someone be in on that one? No, he's like fifth string. What number is he? Why is he playing tight end? What? Why is Tyron Smith our fourth tight What? Dude, that is funny. Anywho. No, that's a situation where if, if you take a sack close to the line of scrimmage, it's not that bad, but a loss like that, you can't you can't take a sack there. Yeah, absolutely. The one thing you cannot do, they did. Was that CD Lamb? He didn't run exceptionally fast there. I was kinda confused. I mean he's a little slower than Amari Cooper is is what it is, but that was just extra slow for him. I don't know. That was weird. Wouldn't have gotten many more yards, so it's not the end of the world. It was just strange. Whatever. See, he's still really good now, but he's going to start regressing at age 29 or 30. So, he's 27 right now in this universe, I believe. So, I think that means we get rid of him at 29, because his contract's massive. And that'll be the peak of what we can get for him. After that, it's going to be, you know... Incomplete, are you kidding me? Um... But, um, yeah, that's the best we're going to get for him before he starts regressing, you know. Okay, let's see. Can we... Yeah, that was a risky one. Yeah, fourth and five, huh? I guess we'll go for the field goal here. I hate going in the 20. Uh, it was a risky shot, but I mean, nothing else was open, so we took what we got. And no return, man, I tell you what. I don't even know what I just clicked. I was just trying to get in ahead. I don't know why I lagged on a head there. Like, my body, like, did a physical lag. I was like, a head. Waited way too long. He saw him coming and didn't even try to get rid of it. Neville Gallimore. I tell you what, he's pretty solid for his rank. I do quite like him there. I don't think we really need an upgrade there. Him and Stefan will be good. You feel me? Oh, oh, I hate when that glitch happens. Good run. But yeah, I hate how it does that with the um, person. Like you're trying to you're trying to get out and instead it just starts glitching them to the left for no reason. Did it with Demarcus Lawrence. I was doing it again. Oh my god. Oh my what the hell? Why did he just <laughs> What? God, gotta look. You're, you're good. He had and then he like like, he got through when he shouldn't have, and then he ran backwards, so it, like, evened out, but, like, okay, let's see. So he catches it, right? He runs into his own player, whatever, then runs into his own player again, but somehow manages to, like, skirt around him. Then instead of taking the open space there, he runs, like, what happened there? Was he grabbed or something? No. Oh my god. Okay, I'll be right back.
Anywho, one thing I noticed is that the screens keep moving even though time is frozen. That's a bit strange. Um, ignore my neighbor's truck outside. God, it is so chaotic for no reason right now, and I literally don't understand why. I apologize. Um, but yeah, so I'm not entirely sure why he just decides to flip around there. Like, first of all, he should have been tackled right here, and the fact he somehow isn't and still manages to keep moving, I don't know. But then, is it because he gets hit there, maybe? No. Dude, what is this game's logic? I'm so confused. So confused. I forgot we even got a guy named Brittingham in all honesty. Oh, come on, block. What is wrong with you? That was an open lane. I'm sorry, Tony. I'm sorry they failed you there. I apologize for that one. That was just the worst block I've ever seen. The O-line is also notoriously bad then. This game is just blocking. Mine is pretty good, but I also have, like, a god-tier O-line featuring two, you know, a Hall of Famer and a possible Hall of Famer. I didn't mean to click that. I didn't mean to click that. That could have been so bad. I was trying to throw it away, and my brain just shut off for a second there. It wasn't even that I misclicked. My brain just shut off. I was trying to, I was like, throw it away, and I clicked B instead. Oh, you get Jason Wynn. He's just so dominant compared to, come on. Ah. God, he was wide open too. That was an interesting look there because as soon as he got outside the pocket, I thought he was going to take off and run for yardage. But what often I thought it was just too covered with Chase Young. Defenses want to try and keep bodies in front of him, and I think that discouraged him from taking off. I almost ran into him. That could have been bad, but I didn't fully see if he had done it at first yet. I was like, did he? With no return, and it will be Washington football now with a first and ten. God, whoever that was running was super fast, though. Ooh. <laughs> Antonio Gibson's kind of a god. He had that one crazy good line. Or not line, a game against the Cowboys. That was just ridiculous. He was so good. Oh, he's done. He's done. Who's 26? I'll join him later, in all honesty. Uh, our uh, MVP himself. And they lost. I oh, know they gained some. That was just a 10 yard line right there. <laughs> I didn't mean to stop him from running. Hopefully they can block here. Okay, you know what? Not the worst block in the world. I'll take it. He did his job. But see, the other one it was wide open, and they just missed a punt that could have gone for an extra 10, 20 yards. Ah. Yep. Man, there's nothing. I'm 2 of 7 right now. Oh my god. I don't like the play calls they're doing either, though. The whole, you know, curl and just stand still. Because they're, they're, they're covering it. I saw. He had, he had some room there. I was like, oh, I'll take a calculated risk. Maybe it's interception, but with Amari Cooper, probably not. God, all these curl routes. I don't like them. It's just not how my team operates. Why would you move to your left? Oh well. I mean, even riskier calls like this one. Why is Brittingham back out here? Screw it. We're going to pass to him. Ah. <laughs> what is, why is he out here? I'm so confused. God, please block Chase Young for long enough. Come on. Come on. Ah, ha, ha. 
We're going to do something crazy here. We didn't do any runs that drive. Let's just... Oh! <laughs> oh, I'm not even mad. We lost it, but I'm not even mad. I'm not even mad. That was an insane block. Oh, my gosh. I thought he had it for sure, and then just... Whoa-bang. Wow. I'm laying Van Der Rush on the sack. Let's go. Not the sack, but the tackle. My bad. A sackle. <laughs> oh my god. This is a hard end game. I know they hate each other, but like, jeez. Ain't no, okay, I was about to say. What's a flag? If it's roughing the pass, it's going to be, yep, I knew it. Whatever. That's my bad. <sighs> That's frustrating. That's my bad, but it's also a bad call. Oh yeah, good hit on guys. No, don't. Oh, what a piece of crap. He's not even going to be in next year's game, so I don't really care about him. I'll be quiet, Sid. Haskins back to the air. That is caught at the seven yard line. Now watch. Oh, they call timeout. I was about to call timeout. But what is he barking at? I swear if it's our dang neighbors, man. Uh, it's probably the mailman. I'm um, Ben, it's our mailman. Oh, it's the UPS truck is here. Fence, I know you see how chaotic my life is. What is up with this? What is up with this? My mom distracts me and my you know then my buddy Kieran calls me, and then my dad calls me, and then, you know, Jake's asking me to join his party like twice, and then the UPS truck man has come. Oh, my God. It better be my present. My sister's birthday present for me still hasn't come. I swear, if that ain't it, hell, oh, it probably is. We'll see. I'll open that afterwards. We're going to play the rest of this game out. Yeah, see how chaotic my life is? Oh my god, shut up, Sid. He left. I saw him leave. And it's wide open. Wow, who left him wide open? Actually, it was Zone. That's who left him wide open. Should have called Man, but I don't trust Man. It's going to be a booth review, but they're going to get it. It doesn't matter. Yeah, he. Had, oh, actually, did he ever get the second one in? Yeah, he did. He did. One sec. Why is the UPS truck man still in his car? That's the question. I mean, it's going to be kickoff, but... Yep. Alright, we got 40 seconds with three timeouts. That's still possible. God, I need Trayvon Diggs back on that. He was so much faster. I mean, he wasn't more effective, but, you know... We get ball back, so. That was stupid. But three seconds is three seconds. Alright, let's get. Uh, okay. God dang it! Dang Chase Young on the shed, man. He is so good. He is so freaking good. 
We're going to have to go CD Lamb here. I mean, come on. Come on. God dang it. No, I'm not going to chew clock. Oh, please tell me he caught it. Oh, he had it, and then he fumbled. Let's see, one foot down, two foot... Oh, second one's out of bounds! No! No! That is such a shame. Yep. Ah, uh, if he had gone one foot in, man, that would have changed everything. This challenge was initiated by the guys in New York taking a look at the play. Less than two minutes to go. Yeah, I'm sure the coach wanted to challenge it, so he's probably going to send the New York office a holiday card. The Cowboys going to use their second timeout now. As the clock will stop with 20 seconds to go in the first half. They show run with three Come on, let's at least get in the field goal range. Mari Cooper, man. Block good, block good. Come on, beat him. Beat him. Ah. Uh. Okay. Brittingham on the run. I don't know. We're going to Mari Cooper. All right, please tell me he's in field goal range. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, we're 62 yards. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, we tried. Can't even be mad. That was a good kick. Yeah, we're skipping halftime. I don't care that much. Dude, that's so, uh, can't even be mad about that one. Ooh, good push by Tony Pollard. Let's go, let's go. Is he... Is Brittingham our starting fullback? Like, I don't know. Alright, let's get... To be frank, they gotta feel pretty grateful to be in the ball game. I would agree with you totally because they've done all of nothing offensively in this game. Bro, what was that throw? Yeah, find themselves in a position on this drive where a touchdown can give them the lead. They need all right, to let's get Don Schultz here. Still looking for that first touchdown here in the third quarter. All they have so far, the field goal. Being chased out. That's gonna be a hold. It doesn't matter. It's gonna be a hold. Yep, don't even matter. Ryan Kelly, we traded for you, man. We traded for you, and you're going to give us a second and 20. And we always talk about hidden yardage in a game. That's going to count as that because now it doesn't go on the books. All right, Blake Jarwin right here. Come on, why would you underthrow it like that? Why would you underthrow it like that? Come on. He had so much open room if you just threw it a little higher. Come on. Yeah, the only person is going to be Cooper. The only person we're even relatively looking at. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, I thought he was going to jump on me, so I trucked. Let's go, Cooper. What a run. What a run. I'm so mad I trucked there, but I don't actually know if it would have mattered or not. He probably would have snow, uh, toe snagged me anyways. Why am I so far out? Am I always this far out? Alright, 
Opted to run for it. The decision, a good one. Picking up the first, getting 14 yards on the scramble. Partner, he was going through I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, this is how close I usually am. I don't know why I was so far back out on that one. Easy. Easy. Feed him, man. Feed him. Let's go. Let's go. Absolute legend. I don't want to. What? More options. Did I accidentally click it? Custom play options. Play full game. There we go. Good play, good play. Yes, sir. Is he? God, just lay him out, man. Maybe a good spot to take a shot. He's such a piece of crap, man. Oh, what could have been a great block. Oh, well, good play, good play. Jordan Lewis on the sack, you know. Super Bowl MVP, Jordan Lewis. Yeah, I tell you what, we don't have a left outside linebacker out here all too much, so, you know, having Tony Overton there, not not the worst. But D-Law, yes, sir. I wish I could trust my team. Oh, that's going to be close. Ah, good play. Um, what a good play. But I wish I could trust my players to play man more. I just don't. Especially in Madden. From midfield now, Haskins. And his throw's gonna be incomplete. So the passing windows are just not. We're gonna do another blitz. Another example of how great this defense has been all game long. And that's exactly what a top ten defense can do. They can really change the game tempo and frustrate you as you try to execute off. Please tell me that was Darius guys. Oh, I was in Oh man. Oh, 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 yeah, throw him down, Jalen. Throw him down. Let's go. Throw his ass. Brennan Ham seems to be our, you know, big new player. I mean, my God, he's out on every play. Wow, they're going to fake it. <laughs> Is that Jordan Lewis? So let's say the punt was 30 yards, right? Let's say the punt was 30 yards. Where did they start from? The, uh, let's say the 45. Where did we end up getting it back to? <laughs> like the 32, it was a 13-yard punt, essentially. <laughs> Dude, that is great. I'm good for them for taking a shot. Yeah, Jordan Lewis, Super Bowl MVP, gets the interception. All right, let's make something here. Come on, come on. Thread the needle. Let's go. Perfect throw. Perfect throw. Perfect throw. 
What a run. Cross body. I just want to see if he can hold on and Blake Jarwin can. That's why we keep him, man. That's why we didn't draft another tight end. I miss. I, 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 oh. I miss. Uh, bro, why is my brain just dying? Easy. I remember what I was saying. I miss Jason Wynn. I miss Jason Wynn. <laughs> I don't know why it like. I was like, wait, what was I saying? <laughs> I saw CB Lamb on a slant and it was over, man. It was over. I thought it was going to be an interception, and I just, I was like, ah, oh, shoot, but he managed to catch it because our receiving core is just brilliant, man. Ah, oh, that's going to be... Oh, well. It is what it is. I dove. I shouldn't have dived there. Oh, well. Ah, uh, yep. Neville Gallimore, yeah. Not his fault. We won't get mad at him for that one. Oh, shut up, announcers. Shut up. I could wrap up, Jalen. Not the hard hit I wanted, but a decent one. We're going to go corner blitz. Oh, my God. Who's texting me? If it's Jake being mad that I'm not. Oh, oh my God. Kieran, calm down, Kieran. Calm down, Kieran. Oh, good play. What are they? Um... Oh, that hit. Who is that? Brown. There's like six different Browns on my team. Who's, who's the defensive one? What's his name? I don't know. I feel like it starts with a W, but I might be wrong. Oh, uh, he hit me. Bro, he let the he he let the, the receiver hit me. You got you gonna let your coach take that disrespect? Holy crap, calm down, Kieran. I feel like I have like a stalker X or something. Jeez. Oh, oh, what? You're kidding me. Yeah, absolutely just destroy him. Good stuff, Awuzie. The way he got that out accurately while being pressured by like three sides is ridiculous, but whatever. Oh, uh, no fumbles though, man. I tell you what, he just pounded out here with zero fumbles. Oh my god, dude, they're getting destroyed. How are they just holding on every single play? Every single play is a hit stick. Alright, let's see if we can shed the block here. They're going to run it undubitously. Oh, you're going to let Darius Geist score a touchdown on you? Come on. What a piece of crap. Get off my screen. Get off my screen. Washington has made this a one score game. A solid blocking up front from the guys on the offensive line allowed him to get in for the touchdown. Yeah, some might say that the guys on the offensive line were in concert. I used to have a coach who called it marrying up. Meaning, when you get on a guy, you just stay right there. Each guy has his own assignment that allowed the runner to make the big move towards the end zone. 
Whatever, we're just wasting time at this point. It's a field goal. Wow, they really didn't punt there. Or do a... Huh. Okay. I mean, we'll just take our time with it, honestly. Oh, come on. You're a tight end and you can't even chuck that dawn. Come on. Two minute warning. I'll take it. Now they're just going to want us to chew clock, which, come on. That's such a lame thing. In a six-minute quarter, the last two minutes is just chew clock. I get it. We're winning, but, like, on, do it, like, the last 30 seconds. Make it, like, realistic to the game. You feel me? We'll go my favorite sluggo at the end, you know. See if we can get Cooper here. Or maybe Brittingham. I mean, oh, he's blocking. Oh! <laughs> Dude, that was so should have been intercepted, too. Oh, well. Keanu kneels on the Redskins now instead of on the Cowboys. Oh, bro, come on. Oh, he didn't even give me time to slide. How rude. Ah, why'd you catch it like that in that weird animation? God, I hate curls. Why did I just pick a curls? <laughs> oh my god, whatever. God, that's some BS. <laughs> Oh, are they? Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. Third booth review of the game, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, uh, I think he's down. Let's see, when's he lose it? Knee. Yep, we're good. We're fine. Let's get Brittingham here. I want to get him a catch. This random middle linebacker who for no reason in particular is... <laughs> I'm trying him, man. Oh, they got a whole minute. Shoot, I didn't think this through well. Because, I mean, if they get a touchdown, which let's be real... Come on! <laughs> He was so open. He was so open. Are you messing with me? He was so open. How are you not going to make that one, Dak? Oh, come on. Drop the ball for once in your life. Oh, he's done. And that's the game. <laughs> Ain't no way! <laughs> Ain't no way! Oh my god! Oh my god! You were. Yeah, he's hit as he's thrown. By who is that? Brown, whoever Brown is on our defense. And it's going right to him, and all of a sudden you just say, nope. Oh, my God, a Leighton Van Der Esch. Player of the dang that week right throw. there. And it'll wind up being intercepted. Oh, 
Oh, we don't do screens very often. Following the interception, here's Prescott. They'll set up the screen to Elliott. And that's why we never do screens. Uh, let's see if we can get Amari Cooper a touchdown right here. Yep. Yep. And he's in the zone. Let's go. Yes, sir. What a catch. He's just too good, man. He's just too good. Well, 10 points in 8 seconds. They're done. I thought they were going to win there. There's Dion Cook in the back, and Cannon and Woods. So we got two rookies in the back. All right, get them an interception. Come on. Oh, he caught that. Oh, well. Oh, what a what a camera view there. Oh, what a camera view there. God, why was this game so glitchy? Like, oh my god, man. Yeah, we just dominated them on paper. I mean, honestly. We didn't have a great game, but on paper, we like crushed them. 48% completion rating. That is awful. 3-0. Not too shabby if I say so myself. I got to go to some senior night thing tonight. But afterwards, I'll probably do an episode or two tonight. We'll see. Let's see, no upgrades available. Some guy named Derek Shepard. Is he the guy we drafted? I don't actually know. Um, they go to one and two. Got a very different season for them so far. I tell you what. Yeah, how is Birmingham even out here? I'm so confused by him. Yeah, see, we have Noah Brown and Eric Brown at wide receiver. We have... Yeah, he's our backup, you know... Uh, Right outside linebacker. Oh, he's the guy who's also the backup uh, left end guy. Yeah, the one with the cool helmet. Check him out. Check him out. Let's see. We'll show his helmet. Yeah, look at that helmet. He's kind of a beast, honestly. Yeah, yeah, he'll do. He, he, he's our good special teams guy. He's all right. Uh, yeah, let's check our special teams. What's that look like? Greg Zerline, Chris Jones, Zach Marnazar. Okay, okay. Yeah, look, Tony Pollard. Look how good of a kick returner he is. That's just crazy. Ooh, who's it? Eric Brown could be a decent kick returner if we ever got rid of Tony Pollard. That's good, if nothing else, because he doesn't get a lot of play time. He will next season. He'll be our number three next season because we're getting rid of Michael Gallup. He's just too expensive, especially when we already have CeeDee Lamb and Amari Cooper. Too expensive to bring back. Same with Chris Jones. We don't punt a lot. That's someone I'm okay getting rid of for a way cheaper option. So really, the only ones I really care about this year are Don Terry Poe and Dak Prescott. Those are the two we got to bring back. And I want to bring back Dorrance Armstrong because he's just our backup at everything. So those three. 
don't know. We'll have to see what our cap space is like. We're facing the Raiders next week. And that should be interesting. Um, Returning from injury. Who is back? Um, Our backup middle linebacker is a 63. You know what that sounds like to me? Useless. That sounds like You've at least got a cup one more year over Jason, you know, our boy tight end mill linebacker specialty, uh, uh, Jason, uh, or Jamal, my apologies, Jamal Brittingham. Okay, absolute legend here, who I don't even think I've customized. Yeah, no, I haven't. Um, absolute legend right here, because I don't even know, I, I think I knew he existed. Yeah, no, that sounds to me... Like he's gonna be our backup, <laughs> our backup, backup middle linebacker. How how much experience does this guy have? Two years, so he's one year older than. Uh, or no, he's two years, uh, his senior, and he's only three overall higher. Yeah, no, you're useless. All right, let's let's see these college points. Let's see what's available for us. I'm kind of worried about this class. Maybe we go wide receiver. See if there's any. Okay, options there. Okay. Um, probably not a first round guy that we want. Okay. Maybe like a fourth round guy who's real good. Like maybe this guy. Not bad value, I suppose. Also not bad value. Nope. Okay, Daryl Locke could be our, um, yeah, he is really good fifth round talent. All right, let's check the draft board. We have, um, let's get rid of this guy. We're not drafting a wide receiver in the first round. We have two great wide receivers and Eric Brown on the up and come, you know. Um, what other positions? QB is going to be an absolute heartache this year. Maybe defensive tackle. We do have one defensive tackle going in the first round. And he's not very good. So we're going to pretend uh, pretend he's not. Greg Dockett out of Alabama could be something. He's a scheme fit, speed rusher out of Alabama. That could be something good. Anywho, my apologies. Um, yeah. Um, Poe, I think, might be the only player we're bringing back. It Dak is the big maybe, but Poe is Poe is really solid for the position. I mean, we do have Armstrong there, who could be our starter, but or Stefan McGee, or Stefan, Stephen, Stephen McGee, Stefan. I don't really know with him. His name is Steven. I remember that as a group. Steven. Okay. We got, uh, was it Darius Shepard? Derek Shepard. Derek Shepard. Uh, Steven McGee. Jamal Brittingham. Devontae Cannon. Dion Cook. Is there anyone else I need to remember? I think that's all our defensive players we drafted. And then Eric Brown. Eric Brown could turn into something. I hope he gets more playing time. I really do. He's not playing a whole lot. Yeah. I mean, that's all I can think of doing right now. Um, cause our cap space is just completely awful
<sighs> yeah, we're still negative 13 in the hole. Why does it still say hold A to reorder? What are we reorder? Okay, you know what? Whatever. It's been a real week. I don't know why it's super mega glitchy today, but we're 3-0. What a start to the season. Raiders, Raiders could be tough. They're not ever particularly good. But, I mean, they, they could be tough. Yeah, it could be scary, man. But, anywho, I will see you guys later. Peace out.